In these mystical, uncharted woods, the mage and the assassin tread carefully, aware that danger lurks around every corner. Each footstep and overturned branch could lead to peril. The forest, dense with ancient trees and veiled in a thick, eerie mist, whispers secrets of the past and forewarnings of the future. The air is thick with magic, almost palpable, as if the woods themselves are alive and watching. Emerging from the mist is the infamously nefarious Ice Queen, her frosty aura sending shivers down their spines, bracing for the inevitable confrontation. Excuse me, but what are you doing in my backyard? Fireball. Excuse me, did you just throw a thoggle at me? Why did you do that? Isn't she playing? No, she's clearly a non-player character. Oh, I'm gonna ask her some NPC questions. Do you have a quest for us? Do you have wares that you would like to trade us for gold coins? Do you want to tell us a rambling story about your history of how you ended up living in these woods that have no real value to us except that it will point us down a path that we're supposed to follow? Okay, I don't know what's going on here. Whatever this is, better be a hidden camera show or I'm going to see. Because if not, you have five seconds to get off my property. Relax, Mom. We're just LARPing. LARPing? What is that, Jocelyn? Live action role playing? Role playing! Aki in the backyard where the neighbors can see with three people. No, not that kind. What do you think that means? But I, you know what? I'm gonna just shut up. I don't want to know. Um, it's more like Dungeons and Dragons, but you act it out outside. Oh my lord, Jethalini, you cannot be capricious enough to be out here doing satanic things. We're not doing satanic. Sacrificing things. No. Trying to raise things from the dead. No, that was last week's campaign. This is just a game, mother, and these are my friends. I'm Gowser the Immaculate. Mm, it's nice to meet you, Mr. Demaculate. Is that Scandinavian? No, mother, that's just his name in the game. His real name is Bob. All right, but that's not much better. He's a mage, and this is Circle. Oh, yes, I understand now. Circle is your made-up name in this little game that you're playing. That's her made-up name in the real world. Her LARPing name is Hexagon, and she's an assassin. Imagine being killed by a shape. And who are you supposed to be, Jocelyn? Oh, let me guess. Artisanal. No, it's Artemia, mother. You know this. I'm the game master. I have never been more confused in my life. What is happening here? Are you putting on a little play? Is this Shakespeare in the park? A Greek tragedy? Okay, it looks like the Three Stooges. Okay, mother, I get it. You think we're weird. Now you can go back to your Pilates and wine tasting class. No, no, no. I want to take an interest in your life. You know, you didn't want to be involved in the pageant world and you took no interest in the equestrian sports. <laughs> but this game might be my opportunity to take part, okay? I'm, I'm very interested. Show me the way. What should she play as? Which? No, absolutely not. I don't care what my ex-husband says. Heal her, because she's a mom. Viva Peru, am I right? While I may be a very nurturing mother, the true healer is our Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ. Alchemist? Alchemist. Hmm. Yes. I like that. It sounds classy, no? What do you think, Artemia? Alchemist. Porque everything I touch turns to gold. To make her an interesting NPC, we gotta make her some kind of villain. Oh. What's her villain origin story? Does she belong to an evil sect? Did she steal jewelry from her rich niece? Does she run an underground goblin gambling ring? Does she plan to overthrow the queen? Bueno, that's an interesting origin story. You know what? I don't even want to play anymore. Okay, circumference and Deuteronomy. How do we play this game? It's 
What is, is that my butter knife? Okay, okay. That was it, that was the take. That was the take. <laughs>